Boy, I had broke my back before I went in to prison. Man. Yeah, I broke my spine in three places. How you do that? Running from the police. Dang. Oh, this was right before you? Yeah. Oh. A lot of people don't know that. Well, they just found out now. So yeah, wait, they you, just found so it was out. a chase? Like they chase you? You was on foot? Well, they ain't chase nothing. They they it was one way in, one way out the building. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So they all in the front. They ain't thinking they this girl ain't gonna jump out no window. It ain't no back door. You ain't jump out the window, dude. Who didn't? But I'm so retarded. <laughs> yeah. You jumped out the window. I'm so retarded though, cause I jumped the wrong way. Like, <laughs> way. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you jumped the wrong way? Okay, I should have lived. I should have followed suit. <clears throat> it was somebody that was with me, and they jumped out the window first. You know what I'm saying? And when they jumped out the window, they hung from the window sill. Then they did a little kick up off of the wall. And then when they hit the ground, they did that little roll. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's not like a professional now, jumper. I, it, it was my idea to go out the window. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So you like, let's go out the window. He like, bet. So he did his steps He was like, perfect. no, he looked at me like, what? Out the window? I'm like, Yeah. So like, what? The, right. By this time, wait. So the, the the place is surrounded. Like you got to take us there. Now they all in the front. Okay. Oh yeah, because you say it's only one way in, one out. So they ain't expecting y'all to jump out the. Exactly. Okay. So you suggest the window. <laughs> yeah. He looking at you like you you tripping. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, he just on some. All right. Yeah. He got his shit together. Yeah. He did his shit. Now here go now, me. Now your turn. See what I did was, <laughs> I stood on the window sill. Mm. Jump even higher up. No. Yes, I did. <laughs> Why did I do that? Why did I do that? You, nobody jumps. Man, I stood on the windowsill and jumped even higher. <laughs> and all I told myself, I'm telling myself, like, just land on your feet. Just land on your feet. And that's exactly what I did. I landed on my feet. Mm. And that pressure, the impact, it was. Right. Yeah. Dang. I still got away. You still, still got, got to running? I, I ain't get the running. I was, it was like my body went to go spring back up and it got stuck. Like just how I'm sitting, it got stuck in like sin position. And I just fell over like a board. And <clears throat> I just remember praying. I just prayed. I prayed to my grandma. I prayed to my grandpa. I prayed to my native ancestors. I was praying to God. Just give me the strength to just get up and just let me, please just let me crawl in the bushes. That's all I was saying. And I... Like, this is my testimony on some real deal. Like, if you never felt his power, I felt it. I never seen the sun shine so bright, like, on some real stuff. The sun was just, like, on me, and I'm just praying. Like, just give me the strength to crawl in these bushes. I somehow I crawled in the bushes. And when I got in the bushes, it was a whole bunch of, like, red ants and mosquitoes, and they was eating me. So I'm like, I get to praying again. And it seemed like that sun came on the other side of the building. I'm looking up. I'm just praying. Just give me strength to get up and walk. Please let me get up and walk. I somehow I got up and I got the walk and I was walking messed up. I even tried to jump the fence. But you know how like the fence if it's like real flimsy at the mm -hmm. bottom? It was like that, so I couldn't get that. And it hurt it so bad. And I mind you, I couldn't make no noise. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't cry, I couldn't make no noise because right. they right on the other side of the building. <clears throat> so I ended up sneaking right past them. They was all looking up at the door. And I snuck right past them. I walked like a block. And somebody ended up picking me up. Um and I went to the hospital, and they asked me, was I able to walk? I said, yeah. They said, well, your back not broke. And I'm steady telling my back is broke. My back is broke. You know, they can't give you no type of pain, nothing, until they figure out what's going on with right. you. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so he put me through a CAT scan, did the MRI. He came back, and he was like, well, hey, you did break your spine. I actually broke it in three places. And then he showed me the CAT scan, and it was actually a bone sticking into my spinal cord. And you could see the indent from the bone pushing into my spinal cord. And he was like, I don't know how you was able to walk. He, he Then he started to say that I was um, in shock and I never walked. But the person who picked me up was right there with me. And she was like, no, she walked. She walked like a whole block. Dang. That's great. So is that where the police end up getting you from, the hospital? Nope. I got up out of there, too. <clears throat> yeah, but it was crazy, though, because... I really believe, like, if I didn't get up and walk right then, I, I don't think I ever would have walked again. 
on some real right. being honest. And then when I came out of my first surgery, um, I was in surgery for six hours. And when I came out of that surgery, my whole left side of my body was paralyzed. The whole left side was paralyzed. And I just remember I was crying. I'm like, break it back. Just break it back. Because I was walking. I don't care how I was walking. I was walking and I was moving. You know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. This whole side was dead. No feeling, no movement, no nothing. And they hurried to put me to sleep. And I came up out of that surgery and I was able to. Do you still have complications from that oh, today? Yeah. Yeah. Dang. Mm-hmm. It's like I'm I'm used to living with the pain, you know, because when I was in prison, they didn't give me the type of medical attention right. I needed right. and stuff like that. I was actually supposed to stay in a back brace for five years. Um, when I got to the county, they took my back brace and, and told me if I wanted to keep my back brace, uh, I would have to be in lockdown for 24 hours. And I did that probably for like three weeks because I'm like, I need this. And then I just couldn't take it no more. So I just gave up my back brace. Dang, that's crazy. Yeah. That is crazy. Yeah, you lucky to be walking and, yeah. and everything. And you're not that big of a person, so that... You know what I'm saying? You could have man. Actually, it could have been ten times worse. It could hey, actually. And then because so, lesson, ladies and gentlemen, if jumping out of a, a window, please just jump down, just just fall down. Like don't jump up. And it's, only time you jump up is if you diving in a pool or something. Don't jump up to. Hey, but see, here's the positive in that. They just learned how to jump out of a window. See that. <laughs> You gotta find the positive, ladies and gentlemen. They learn how not to jump out of a window. How not to jump out of a window by Pocahontas, ladies and yeah. gentlemen.